guys know me, I will test a sunscreen. I won't play. I won't joke about this. Like. <laughs> We are testing out a sunscreen today, a sunscreen stick. This is a 50 SPS by Bear Republic Mineral Sunscreen. Yeah, it's it's so cute. It's so little. This is Sport Broad SPF, uh, Broad Spectrum SPF 50, water resistant, free of chemical sunscreen actives. Oh, I don't know what that means. Um, it says it's non-nano reef friendly, cruelty free, GMO free, gluten free. Uh, I thought I would try this on. It says... Good, clean, fun for all life's adventures. Non-nano zinc oxide protects physically, not chemically, while a natural coconut vanilla scent and lightweight application will help you keep your cool even in the most extreme conditions. So you know what? I'm gonna put this sucker to the test. You guys know me. I will test a sunscreen. I won't play. I won't joke about this. Like, so we're gonna go ahead and test it out because I'm taking a long drive. We're going on a little like a uh, family vacay. Um, so I'll take you guys with me and tell you, hey, did I burn? Did I not burn? This is what it looks like. Let's see if it actually has that fragrance. No, 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 it doesn't have that fragrance. Natural coconut vanilla scent. No, now that's a lie. It has a fragrance, but it's definitely not that. So I am going to be applying this. I'm going to apply it to my face. I'm going to show you guys me applying it to my face and see. Did I burn? Did I not burn? I don't know. Let's go ahead and just jump on over to that review of me putting it on right now. And especially on your hands, guys, when you're driving, come on, put the sunscreen on your arms and your hands. Look at the difference, how youthful it makes me look. Um, but then again, I do have a... Uh, a self tanner on this arm compared to that arm. Uh, anyways, I will let you guys know what I think. I'm gonna take it down a little bit further and put it on my chest because I told you guys, like I do burn so, so super, super quick, but I will be doing the check-ins with you guys and let you know what I think. Hey, maybe I'll even convince Karen to try it out. Uh, Karen is much darker than I am, so I don't know. Typically, she doesn't like mineral sunscreens because she's like, it leaves me too ghostly white. Let's see if it does or doesn't, if she'll even try it. But I'll see you guys in a bit. One of the things that burn the most on me are my feet. So I'm actually going to put this on the top of my foot right now. Okay. Okay, so don't judge. Yes, my feet look horrible. Horrible, horrible. I need to get a pedicure. I'm just going to rub this because my foot is burning really bad i can feel it okay so this is going to be the ultimate test for this sunscreen we are in sand hollows utah you can see the mountains the lake behind us it is beautiful and it is overcasted right so it's, the clouds are going in and out but i always a hundred percent burn burn in my face when i'm at the lake doesn't matter if it's overcasted or not so i'm gonna put this all over my face and we're gonna see do i burn or not Okay guys, so I wanted to show you these um, amazing, amazing floats that uh, we purchased here for the lake. They are so freaking big. I got them off of Amazon, or actually Red got them off of Amazon. They are amazing. Let me show you really quick. Okay, so look how big it is, guys. That is huge. It's like a sheet that floats, and the back can be rolled out more. It's so huge. It holds so many people, and you just lay there and relax. And then we got this other one. Look at this. So you can lay back and lounge or you can sit on the chairs and put your feet in. I actually don't usually post stuff like this in my description box or my comment section, but I'm going to post these two if I can find them on Amazon. What, you know, because we bought them off of Amazon. They are amazing. And if you're going to take a water trip, or you're going to go to the lake, the ocean. These things are so much fun. And that one that lays down flat, that's orange. You can also stand on it. It's almost like, you know, you can paddle with the paddle and stand on it, which is so cool. And multiple people.
Okay. You want to come in my shade? Oh, say hi I to like everyone. Say hi to oh, everyone. Guys. She's holding a big umbrella right here. We don't want to get dark. Okay. Hi. <laughs> so I was telling everybody about the gadgets that Red bought. I think it was Amazon. It was Amazon. So yeah. I was telling him I would post the links down below for them. Heck yeah. Yeah, because that thing's freaking amazing. That can fit like seven. Yeah. Uh -huh. So he's tall. So look at this. See, it gets a little bit of water on it, but I'm still floating. So even if you puncture this one, it's not gonna, it's not like, you wanna say hi? Kristen, say hi. Now tell them why you like this one so much more. Uh, because it gets water on it. Yep, because it gets water. Oh, I'll show them the mask, put the mask up. So this is the coolest mask. Do I have, yeah? So you see, it like covers his whole face. And then look at her her mask. It's the same one? Uh -huh. Yep, look at that, that's so cool. You can put that underwater and does an underwater shot. Okay, now uh, pause it and look at it. What do you have there? Oh goodness. Wish me luck, y'all. She's gonna be in charge of my life. Pray for me, y'all. <laughs> So I just returned from uh, the lake. I showered. I do not look like I'm burnt. I'm gonna go in different light. Actually, I'm gonna give myself around two hours for my skin to calm down because that's a lot of times when my redness will come out. You see how many freckles I get all over my face. I mean, all over from the sun. This is typically what happens to my skin. I get some hyperpigmentation as well but you can see like i'm very spotty but i don't look burnt so i'll be back in about two hours to show you guys what my skin looks like oh yeah and just to put things in perspective so i don't see any burnt on my any redness on my skin not really maybe a little right here but look when i come down to my chest area and my arms and this had a different spf all over me look at that wow Okay, so there you go. The redness kicked in. You can see it in my nose right here, a little bit up here. A little bit, but overall, right here, probably because I wipe like this and wipe my nose the most, but overall it looks good. But in comparison to my chest, I would actually say this is a super good sunscreen. 
Okay, okay, so it's really late at night. We're both exhausted. Actually, you know what? I put the sunscreen on her under eye area. Just that part, though. Yeah. And then everything else, I put the Neutrogena. But look, do you notice in camera how she's whiter here? She's whiter under her eyes. Look at that. Wow. It looks like, because that's the strip that I put it on, and then it was that thick. It was like, boom. Yeah, you did. You put it and really boom, thick. And it's whiter there, which means it protected your skin better. Yeah. Well, tell them what it's, you... Okay, so I, I don't know what, what the SPF off, the one that you were trying, but 50. the one that... Okay, so the... That, <laughs> Sorry. The, you you pulled another um, yeah panoramic view. Yeah. So cool. When we're when view. we're taking a panoramic view, okay. we we're all into the video, all into the panoramic, and we're like, look, and then boom, boom. <laughs> right into the water. Um. Anyways. So anyways, the Neutrogena that I use right here is the thick cream one, the one that comes in a yellow bottle, and it's the SPF seventy, if I'm not mistaken. That was a 70. Oh. 70 right here. And then the one My, that you put right here. So the one that I put actually worked better because she has two white lines under her eyes there. Mm -hmm. Tell them what you think of me. Let me see. Well, I can't really see because we're not in a dark, we're in a dark light. Do I look red though? You don't look red in here because I'm looking at you and the shade is right there. Zumi, can we borrow your phone or Hazel, can we borrow your phone for a second? Just that we want to borrow the light on it. Oh, good, good, good. Okay, here we go. Okay, now. Can I have it? <laughs> I'm pink, I'm red, I'm burnt. What? I compare, your, compare it to my chest. Compared to your chest, your chest is red. Mm. Your face, not so much. <laughs> but there are, there are a little bit of red on you. Like here and here. Not right, yeah, like kind of like right here. Uh -huh. And then kind of like right here. Uh -huh. And then just a little bit right here. I applied it twice. And how many hours were we there? We were there from 11 till 6. 11 to Overcast. 6. 11 to 6, overcasted. I, I always burn it overcast. 11 to 6 overcasted. I applied it two or three times. You only applied it once for me. I did not actually see it until you're showing it to me now. Yeah, look, you have the white, like the white. That is insane. The look white. at that. You put it all the way right there. Yep. That is crazy. And she only applied it once. You know what, guys? And it's like we've had a long day. Yeah, mm -hmm. the travel and all that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anyways. Uh, we approve this. She approves this. I love it. I'll post the link down below if I can find it. I'm Christina Marie. And this is Karen. Bye. Bye. camera and show you my skin the next day you can see that my forehead what, what Karen was talking about especially around here I must have not pushed the sunscreen up um, enough but you can see my forehead is much more red right there um, my forehead is actually kind of red it's not as red as like my chest or let me show you my leg hey, look at that horrible so it's not as bad as the other parts of my body, but it's still red, you can see. But considering like the extreme sports that we were doing and that we were out there for six hours, I think it still is pretty darn good. I love the fact that Karen mentioned uh, the texture because I totally forgot to tell you guys the texture. I love the texture. It feels a little bit like a Vaseline as far as that consistency, a little bit. So it really adheres, but it's not as thick as the Vaseline. So this sunscreen really super adheres to your skin and that's a plus plus.